Hi guys and welcome back to Commodore Forever on YouTube. Got something pretty cool to show you today. Um, I'm sure you have heard about it. It's been out uh, a few months now with um, no support for NTSC machines. But now um, there is some experimental support. Uh, experimental, I guess I would call it beta. But uh, I've been playing it. It works really good. Talking about the Kung Fu Flash cartridge. Okay, it's another storage device option for your Commodore 64 that uh, that's really cool. You, you can take um, program files or cartridge files and load them into this thing and then uh, select them through a browser. Boom, you're loading up programs almost instantly. So let's just uh, get right to it. We're gonna show you what it does here. Um, I've got my SD card uh, preloaded with a lot of um, files, program files and cartridge files. And I've, um, I've already loaded one in here. And as you can see, uh, it keeps its memory from what you loaded last time. This is Aztec Challenge, of course, and I had loaded it in. So, I mean, when you plug it back in, it, it just assumes it's that cartridge. So uh, to um, load another one, you just go to your uh, little button here, hit the menu button. And now we can go back to our browser and browse through all of our program files and whatnot. And... Uh, it seems pretty cool. I, I ran into uh, maybe one or two games that's not working. I uh, might have to, you know, load those again or, or whatever, but there's uh, there's plenty to choose from. So I'm going to load up uh, Beachhead here because Beachhead was one that always took a little while to load. Um, and as you can see how quick it loads it up. Um, very cool. I, I like everything about this little little deal but um yeah that's it that's that's what it is another storage device option for your commodore 64 um works great i'm not having any issues so far on this uh on this machine there are you know i know going to be some issues because this is a this is a pretty new device and the firmware he uh he's updating it pretty regular the the one i have on here now is 1.20 um which just came out four days ago so and uh you know i say uh i say you know it's awesome to have all these different options for storage and i really like the fact that once you load it in you turn it back on and it's still there you know i think that's cool um now um i haven't got all into this as far as how it works with d64s uh, and whatnot, um, because it's relatively uh, a new device still in development. So, anyway, I like what it's doing so far. I don't have anything uh, bad to say about it uh, or negative to say about it at all. Um, I can't wait to see you know what all this ends up doing, and um, you know, good luck to the guy that's <laughs> developing. I think he's doing an awesome awesome job um and i don't want to butcher his name but um we'll try to zoom in here to his github address um kim georgensen i guess uh, that's how us americans would say it can you see that colton there we go i'll put a link up in the description and we'll have some pretty cool little pop-ups up here that, that uh you know show you the the address and everything but anyway kung fu flash um uh, all I'm doing right now is uh, finishing up the cases for it and the labels for it. I uh, should have this available in the shop, I'd say, in just a, you know, a couple days. Yeah, this is awesome. Check it out on uh, www.commodoreforever.net.